Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and we're working on page one, Warm Wishes from Graphic 45. And this is gonna be a very simple page, if I can move it. Um, we're gonna have two cards, two cards, and these cards are uh, eight and three eighths by seven and one eighth. Eight and, eight and three eighths by seven and one eighth, and you're gonna score it in half. Um, so what I did is I took my eight and a half by 11, I scored it four and a half, then I, I folded it and then I placed it in my trimmer and cut it four and one eighth by seven and one eighth. And that's how I got these two cards. So you're gonna need two of those. And then let's see, where's page one? Yeah, page one. We're going to use this beautiful, I know it's hard to, to cover this up, but we're gonna use this as the background on page one and you may have noticed if you're working on this album that I did build it uh, out of page sequence so we're going to go ahead and lay this down I've already inked it that's my husband starting up the car the camera shares the same wall as the garage <laughs> that's one wall the other wall is my air conditioner <laughs> If I ever have a dream house, uh, my craft room won't be, um, won't have a, a share a garage wall and it, it clearly won't have an air conditioner outside. I don't know why they don't put air conditioners on the top of the houses like they do in big cities. They're ugly to look at and they make a lot of noise. Uh, I suppose you just hear it upstairs then. Okay, so there's our background. Then we're gonna place these two like so. So you're gonna have these large photo mats. Um, and we are looking for an equal frame. So we're gonna center these. And it looks like, I'm gonna measure it so I'm not guessing, but it looks like it's about a half inch. Yeah, a half inch and a little bit on it. Okay, so I'm going to draw some reference lines. That's a quarter. There's my half inch. And then once we get one in, we're going to measure the second one off the first one. So I'm going to lay this in, see how it looks. Nope, that's too tall. So we're going to have to come down. So I think a half inch in is right. These are just over. Oh, sorry, my eyes are itching. I took my allergy medicine today, but it doesn't feel like it. Um, so these are just over seven inches tall. That's why it's not working out to be a half inch. I think that looks pretty darn good. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, well, I should probably do this both sides and take a look at it. I want a nice uh, gap. Yeah, that's going to be fine in between them. And you'll see why in a little bit. Okay. So I'm looking to center it top to bottom and come in about a uh, half inch. The most important thing is that it's in straight. And it is not. Oh my goodness. My nose. It's, so I overcompensated too much. Let's start. Let's do that again. I'm going to put a little more glue on it so I have a little more time to work. I've got my fan running in here. It's not doing me any favors. Mm. 
Okay, there we go. That's it. So now I'm going to use this line to come across. to open away from each other. I'm a little crooked here, but all in all, I think I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not. It's too, too high. Sometimes I swear I can do this better without a ruler. Yep, I'm happier with that. It's just off a tiny bit. Okay, now we're going to use some magnets to hold all this together. So here, here. And go now we're going to decorate the front this is from the 8x8 and it is just split in half between the two panels and I have inked it Okay, this is also from the 8x8 collection. And I'm trying to decide what else I want to do here. But I definitely want to use these two right here. It goes like that. Now I'm going to do a little something down here with our die cuts and our fussy cuts. That's too, too similar. I like this. It actually needs to go that way.
Ooh, I like that. And I think I might want to cut a couple of these out. We need a small point set in. Happy holidays. like that. Might use that someplace else. Okay, I definitely like this. So let's ink it. This was fussy cut off the cover of the 12 by 12. This is a uh, die cut. I'm going to leave it open ended on the top so that you can gently slide uh, a photo behind it if you want to. Same thing here. get your photo behind it. Cute, cute, cute. All right, I have a little bird. Nope, doesn't work. Let me see if I've got anything else that's fun. Now we'll use that someplace else. Okay, now we need to cover um, these two panels. Let me clean up my mess here. And that's usually what it takes is a bunch of spreading things out to, to find something you like. I'm gonna add that. It just gives it a little some, something. Let's see, I just hand punched this. I think I like it over here as a gold. There we go. Nice. Okay. Now we need to find what we're doing with these two sides. So we can continue this pattern. I have enough of this, but that's that's. Oh, I don't know. Let me ch let me cut it and we'll take a look. It's a lot, I know. I forgot, how tall is this? Seven and one eighth, I think. Seven and one eighth. Yep. Oh, that's why it's so, it's so tight. These are foreign. Should be four and one. Yeah, okay. Seven. 
This should be seven. Can't believe it is. There we go. Seven. And seven. Okay. Actually, I kind of like it, but it is a lot. Um, let's think about that for a second. What else would work? We have this red. That would be the option. Is two red ones. Or I don't want to add green because of that. I'm just flipping through what I've got left. This is what we already used on the cover, and it's green on the back. So this is another color that's good, but maybe what we do is we split it. Half this and half this. What do you guys think? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not liking that. This one seems bigger than the other. I don't know how I got so far off. But I have. Huh. Well what to do guys see that looks so wide this one looks fine i must not have cut this one down so we're gonna have to trim something to fit and this won't fit so we're gonna have to come up with another plan let's see what is this, this is seven and a half by eight and one eight i don't know if i've got enough of this i'm very low on on yellow what i have a lot of is green but we're already using hmm. What do you guys think? I need some help. Let's shuffle back through. I don't think I have enough of that. Let's see. I, although I like it. I'm going to measure it out real quick. And I would probably use the solid gold. Okay, and if I'm from here. Actually, I do have enough. How about that? Well, that's awesome. So let's do that. Sorry for all the shuffling. I really didn't think I had enough of this. Okay, so let's double check. Yeah. Okay, that works. Yeah, I like it. I just didn't think I had enough. Okay, let's ink it, put it down, and we'll be done with page one, which I like.
definitely the solid. So much for not leaving a big mark. Don't I have to use it because I am out of gold. No room for errors here. To do. I'm making a mess of this because I just cleaned it before I started this project, so that's just the way it goes. Do some extra cleaning on it. All right, so that is page one, and it. Um, I'm probably going to add a little more here, but you'll have to you'll have to look for that in the walkthrough. So that's it for page one. I like it. I kind of like the way this peeks out. I feel like I could have done come, come up a little bit higher um, with some more. In fact, I could, might be able to fussy cut and put uh, a point set up behind it. Although when I looked through my goodies, I didn't really have one that was the right orientation. Yeah. See, these are supposed to go sideways. I don't know if anybody would would notice but I do um, it really should go that way and I wouldn't I don't know that I'd want to put it over oh good grief that was another dot of glue that would cover up my glue mistake and still leave room for a photo so I don't know I may put some more cut apart stuff on here after um, I finish, yeah, definitely need something red. Finish uh, working with the rest of um, the album and know have a better handle on how much. Oh, there's there's one that I could fussy cut. Have a better handle on uh, how much paper I have left and what I can fussy cut. But for now, we're gonna call it done. There we go. Page one. See you guys soon.